Last week we talked about the staff and the notes on the staff. Today we're going to talk about rhythms. So we're going to start off with this first one here. It's a quarter note. When we read it, we usually say ta. It has one beat and makes one sound. This is a quarter rest. Oops. It doesn't make any sound. It still gets one beat. It takes up one beat of time, but it does not have any sounds at all. These are two eighth notes. We say titi, one beat still, and two sounds. But remember, because they're conjoined at the top up here, that gives us the visual that even though it's two sounds, it's one beat still. Then we have 16th notes. We call them tiki tiki. Still one beat. Again, they're joined at the top to give us a visual of one beat, even though there are four sounds. Don't even worry about my email. Then we have a half note. A size well half. We say ta, but we hold it out. It gets two beats, and we make one sound. Then we have a half rest. We are quiet for two beats. We have to make sure we're counting them because it has to just be two. Now these are all ones that we have talked about before this year. This year we are adding two new rhythms. You might be able to guess what they are. We have Ooh, that was bad. I'm going to do that again. One that looks like this. And one that looks like... Ooh, I didn't like that. This. This is a whole note. We say ta, but we have to hold it out for four beats. And it only has one sound. And this is a whole rest. And we don't make any noises, we don't call it anything. It's four beats of silence. Now looking at this, you might think the half rest and the whole rest look pretty much the same and I might get confused Miss Szymanski, what are we going to do about that? Here's what we're going to do about that. I'm going to show you a trick. The half rest looks like a hat that someone would wear. The whole rest looks like if I was walking down the street and not paying attention, I would have fallen into this hole. So the half rest, half looks like a hat and the whole rest looks like a hole. So hopefully that helps you and makes some sense. The other thing that I want to point out to you, just so you know, because it's something that you could see and of course we'll talk about it again, but this is two eighth notes together. One eighth note all by itself looks like this. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do looks like this, a stem up and a flag. A sixteenth note all by itself looks like this. Of course the circles are not as blobby usually, but when I'm drawing circles on my computer with my finger, they're not going to be as perfect. Stem up and then it has two flags. See one line across the top, one flag, two lines across the top, two flags. We can also have an eighth rest. It looks like this. And a sixteenth rest looks like this with a flag. 
And basically we just keep adding flags. We can have a 30 second note or a 64th note and we would just keep adding flags and just keep adding lines across. We are not gonna do that today. But I just want you to know that those are things. Now, I need two eighth notes to make a whole beat, but I wouldn't put two court, sorry, two eighth rests next to each other. I would just use a quarter rest. We can't do this with the notes because every note has a different amount of sounds or a different way that the sounds happen. So we can't combine the way that we can with rests. But if I have two quarter rests, instead of spending my time writing two of these squiggly quarter rest guys, I'm just gonna write a half rest because it's the same amount. And that helps, that's easier to read too. So it's just see one symbol that tells you how long instead of having to count how many you know single rests or eighth rest or sixteenth rests. So you won't see more than one of these in a row, the eighth or sixteenth. You wouldn't really see one more than one of the quarter rests in a row unless it was like a special thing that we were doing that was made partially to practice the rests and then you might, but for the most part, we kind of just combine. How long do we want to rest for? Just pick the note that represents that. So these are our rhythms. We've got a song that we're gonna do on the next slide. Well, the next slide I'm gonna tell you about the song and then we're gonna do the song. So that is that. I hope you remember this. Remember half rest hat, whole rest Miss Vansky falls into a hole. <laughs>